You're gone. And we have enough, so we can escape the map if we want, but we'll go to round 20. We won't, we won't make this map sh more short-lived than we have to. Are we seriously getting 220 points per kill? That's crazy. Alright. Alright, should we hit the box and see what other guns we can get? Why not? What is that? I think that's a G36. Screw it, we'll take it. An XM8. Interesting. Never seen that come before. Scorpion? No thanks. Actually, pick it up. We don't, we, we, as I said, we can kind of just hang out because we're going around 20, so. I mean, even if we. Wow, it gave me the saw back. Okay. How many zombies do we have left? Three? If I go down here, I'm going to be so annoyed. Easy. Okay. This this character isn't happy with with SMGs. Okay, that's a teddy bear. All right. I don't really know what gun I'm trying to get, but I'll probably only hit the box a couple more times. As like I said, I don't want to waste waste too much time here. But yeah, we have plenty of time. As I said, we're going around 20, so we don't have to we don't have to rush. Okay, it's in this building here. Okay, well we killed we killed one, so we only have two to deal with now. That's actually kind of a good thing I'm thinking. So, all right, where is that mystery box? It's actually really close to Pack a Punch, which is really cool. So, we got a gun that we like. That that XM8 seemed interesting. Never seen that gun before. Is the mystery box here? No. I'm pretty sure it's right above us, kind of in this area. I think there was a mystery box location up here on top. Like, right next to Pack-A-Punch, I'm... I think. Yeah, there was one, but that's not the one I'm thinking of. Hello? Mystery box? There's the light. Huh. Maybe I went too high. Mystery box, where you at? go down this way I'm thinking oh there it is okay it's downstairs downstairs went too high mini Uzi back out the M1014 is definitely gonna be that get out of jail free card weapon just in case things get a little sketchier than I would like Ooh, we almost put him back in the ground. And we got the Winchester as well? No. Crossbow? Don't think I want to use the crossbow. Nice gift though. Dragonov? Mm, I don't think I want that either. But Eh, whatever, I'll grab it. I'll drop him at 50 yards. Is it, are these the world are these the Verruckt voice actors or MP5? Okay. I'm only gonna hit the box till we get twenty thousand points. Or until we get a good weapon. What the heck? I got a shotgun. Oh, the USAS twelve? Yeah, okay, that seems super overpowered, so I'm actually gonna keep that. And we're going to see what else we can get from the box. Come on. I need a point weapon. What do we get? Mm, nope. M40. Cool. I appreciate the offer, Call of Duty, but need something a little bit better than that. We need a point gun, for sure. Come on. I feel like this thing is going to run through ammo so quick, though. Maybe it won't, though. Nope. Ready for some point blank pain? Come on, come on, come on. 
Honestly, we could we'd probably just buy an Uzi off the wall and pack a punch that. No, I don't want Jeez. the scorpion. This guy, this guy lines up with me when when I, when my man pulls a scorpion out of the box. Jeez, why do I have to have this thing? Why do I have to have this thing? Don't know if it's good or not. Don't care either. Oop, teddy bear. Rip. Let's go ahead and pack a punch our USAS. I feel like this thing is just going to be ridiculous. The USAS pack a punched. Maybe we could pack a punch the scorpion as well and just use it as our... Use it as our point gun. That's always a possibility. Maybe we should use it as our point gun. Where'd the box end up? Wow, it ended up right here. That's perfect. Right on our way to pack a punch. All right, I don't want to spend too much more money here. G3, nope. Come on, there's got to be something in that box waiting for me. Perfect. That That's going to work. That's fine. I'll take it. All right, well, we have a brand new set of weapons here. Not sure how I feel about dropping so much money on Pack-A-Punch, but... Okay. But don't don't worry, we'll we'll get plenty of points before round twenty. Big Bertha. And the Ocedius Oh 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 OC I'm pretty sure the map creator was trying to spell Odysseus. Not Ocidi Oh, it's Ocidius. Okay, Ocidius U. Interesting name. I like it. I like it a lot. Okay, let's go ahead and head down, head back to our training area. I want, I really wonder how good this USAS is. I'm very, very curious. I feel like the shotgun is just going to be so ridiculously overpowered. I hope. If it's not good, I'm going to be sad. But I think there actually is an AK-74U wall buy as well. So I think we should be able to get unlimited ammo with this gun technically. Interesting thought. All right, where are you at, last zombie? There you are. Oh, yeah, this thing absolutely destroys them. But it is only round 17, so... I don't think it's that difficult to destroy zombies. How many... Does this thing have 20 shotgun hits? Shotgun shells? See, what is that weird bug? It only happens in that room, and it's super, super weird. Oh, this essay. It looks like they kind of just created this model just by creating the map, which is really creative and cool. Oh, yeah, this thing is going to be so good. I'm so excited to give this thing a go. Like uh, the fully automatic version. But we'll get, we'll get a full horde, so I won't kill anymore until we get a full horde. Having said that, as I said, I don't think there's a zombie limit. Whoa. I don't think there's a zombie limit of how many you can get. So I think... I don't think we'll wait for a full horde. I think we'll just wait to get them kind of all grouped together. Go through here. Oh my gosh. Oh, watch out. Oh my gosh, this thing is so fun. Ooh, insta-kill. Insta Any gun's gonna be good with insta-kill, though. Nice. Double points. Knife and a zombie on round 20. Why the heck not? I mean, round 18. Nice. 10,000 points already. We honestly are earning points really fast, not gonna lie. Nice. Nice. Hopefully there's not much mouse clicking in the video. I don't- I, I think on my Doris series, everything sounds fine there, so that's, of course, good news. Okay, I think there's- I don't know if they're still spawning on the map. I mean, just look how good this gun is. It's so good. The USAS. Oh, 
Now, we don't have any crazy ammo guns, but I think that's fine. I mean, we have a lot of ammo. Kills so fast. All right, round 18. Not too bad. Actually, wait a minute. If I look closer, it kind of looks like... It kind of looks like the Grad Krovi camo, but I don't know when this map was created, so... It also does look like a, a lot like the Exclusion Zone camo from COD 4. I'm not sure. Or from uh, Modern Warfare Remastered, sorry. Not sure. But it's a really cool Pack-A-Bunch camo. Nonetheless, it's definitely a fun map as well. I, I You know, it is a little gray and kind of bland, but... The pack a bunch camo completely ends that right in its tracks. Kind of gets that blend is knocked right out of it with the really nice pack a bunch camo. Ooh, almost got stuck there. I wouldn't have been good. But I, I do think that they have the Shino Numas type of zombies here in custom zombies because if this was Darice, I could have gotten stuck there and that would have been maybe the end of end of my life. Alright, pulling back over here. But I also see people kind of messing with their FOV on World at War, but I'm not sure how to do that. I'm just playing on the base FOV that you get just by playing World at War Zombies, so... I'm not really sure how they improve that, but... Not really worried about it too much. Alright, come on. It's like they keep coming. Keep coming. Right, let's get back over here. And points, 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 points. Turn back around. Points, 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 points. Points, 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 points. 15k. Actually, funnily enough, we may actually play longer than round 20, but I don't think we will. I think we'll be fine. I think we'll be absolutely fine. Itchy nose. Itchy nose. Back over here. All right, I think it may be time to pull out my USAS again. Nice. This gun is so fun. I love it. Oh, look at that recoil. Look at that recoil. Nice. They're definitely still spawning in. Ooh, max ammo. Perfect. I was honestly getting a little worried about ammo. Not too, too worried, but worried enough to be like, I hope we get a max ammo soon. And there it is. Oh, no, 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 no. Jeez, it was, I, I knocked off its head, but it was still able to attack me. <laughs> that would have been such an embarrassing down if we went down to that guy. Nice. We're doing well, though. So far, so good. But this definitely has way more zombies than average rule at war. I don't even think round 20 zombies on Darice have this many. Alright, this gun is getting weak, but that's okay because that's kind of the point. You kind of want a weak point weapon. Alright. We should be able to finish the game on round 20. That's kind of a funny, funny little guess there. But we'll have to, all we have to do is run over there and make sure we press, press F. So, but we'll, we'll get, we'll get till the, to the end of this round where the last zombie is. Yeah, we'll, de we'll definitely gain five and a half thousand points by the end of this round. No doubt about it. I've had a lot of fun though. I have, I have had a lot of fun playing this, so... Hopefully you guys have been enjoying it as well. I think custom zombies I think custom zombies will be a lot of fun to play here on the channel. This won't be a custom zombies only channel. I'm trying to think of the custom zombies only channel on YouTube. I, what is their name? It's two brothers. And I used to watch them a lot back when I was early in the YouTubes. But I can't remember their name at the moment. Which stings. I could just look up custom zombies and I'd know exactly who they are. But at the moment, I don't remember who they are. I wonder if they're still uploading. I don't know. 
so much has changed since 2000, 2013, 2014 when I was watching YouTube. So many things have changed. Like, it's just crazy. I mean, it's insane. People have left. People have, you know, st stopped doing it completely. Moved games. Ali A is kind of the biggest one for me. I mean, he was the first Call of Duty channel I subscribed to, and now he only uploads Fortnite, which is a shame. Because Call of Duty is kind of where the money is at the moment. I think. I don't know. I don't make any money off of this, so I'm not sure. But, it, well, actually, I don't know. I guess there are some really dedicated Fortnite players out there that still love that game. Somehow. Oh, we're so close. But we're going to have to play another round, unfortunately. No, not unfortunately. That's that's a really negative term. Not unfortunately, we get to play another round, which is pretty fun. Enjoying this, enjoying this beach town map. But yeah, as I said in the beginning, I will leave the uh, map in the description in the description, so you guys can play it if you want to. And I will also leave all of the other links to custom zombie maps. So I'll, I'll, I'll of course put Black Ops Three in there as well. In case some of you guys watching this have way better PCs than I do, and then you can play Black Ops 3 Custom Zombies also. But normally, on the website where I downloaded this map, it has those maps just built into it. So it has a Black Ops 3 and a World at War tab. So you can find, you can find really any map you want from any game. And I also think that the Steam Workshop also has a lot of Custom Zombie maps for World at, or for Black Ops 3 as well. I'm not sure about World at War on uh, the Steam Workshop, but... Cause I'm very, I'm very new to PC gaming, honestly, until, oh, that got a little hairy for my liking. Up until about, ooh, gotta sneak through there. Up until about the past month or so, I, I never really even touched uh, PC gaming, but I thought it would be so fun to play zombies on PC, cause it looks, it looks a lot better, and why not? It'd be a lot of fun. So, I, ha I have the PC, might as well use it, right? It's definitely my mentality. So, we'll get to the end of this round here, and then we'll go ahead and end our playthrough. But I'm having a great time. Anyways, back to my conversation. I'm, I'm not sure if... Fortnite is where the money is still. I'm pretty sure it is. I mean... If less and less people are playing that game on YouTube, but there are still people that upload it, then the people that still love that game, as I said, I don't, I'm not sure how, with how sweaty it is, but then those content creators are naturally just making more, making mo a lot of money still, but, I don't know, to me it just seems like that game is just not, it just seems like that game is just not where it was even a month ago, Warzone has been taking over. Which just blows me away. I'm kind of really surprised about that, actually. That Warzone is as popular as it is. Not because I don't. Not because I think Warzone is bad. I just think that Warzone. Just. Oh no. Oh gosh, I almost got stuck there. I just think that Warzone is just a Call of Duty Battle Royale, and not everybody was a big fan of Blackout. So. I don't know. Interesting. But Warzone, I mean, depending on who you'd ask, would say that Warzone is a lot better than, is a lot better than Blackout, but I don't know, I might argue with, I'm not sure. I don't like any of the Call of Duty Battle Royales, if I'm being honest, and the, re the main reason for that is they are frustrating as hell to play. All Battle Royales are frustrating to play to me. I mean, for example, I played Blackout for a while, but I just could not stand getting blown up in that game. Like, nothing's worse than having a good game, like a five or five to ten kill game, and then getting blown up by a grenade 
or a cluster cluster grenade or something like that and ruining your game it's so annoying i just i didn't really like that too much about about blackout and then warzone has rpgs and c4 which is super super annoying i just the one thing i would say i wish they took out of um I wish they took out of Battle Royales in general was just grenades. They just drive me insanely crazy. Part part of the reason is that they're just really cheap. They don't they don't take much skill to use. And they just ruin the Battle Royale experience for me. I prefer having you know gun on gun gunfights in a battle royale, which is completely RNG based. And then if you put RPGs and explosives that take no skill to use, it just completely ruins the game for me. We'll, we'll go back for that uh, max ammo here in a minute. But that, that's kind of just my opinion on how... That's kind of my opinion on... Uh, on Battle Royales. And then, but then Warzone, Black Hat has, had a, has a, just a ton of explosives. And then Warzone has RPGs and C4s, which completely make one-sided gunfights, and I just I just don't like that too much. So, but Warzone is really popular, and bravo to Infinity Ward for creating a solid battle royale. Like, if you can get all the Fortnite players off of Fortnite and back to and back to uh, Call of Duty Warzone, you definitely did something right. Okay, we need to stop using this gun. We're gonna die if we if we use it. Unless unless we have some range. Yeah, that damage dropped off quick. I wonder how low the Thunder Gun RNG is. It's probably pretty damn low if we we hit the box quite a lot of times and then didn't, didn't, didn't get it. Alright, we'll get through. As I said, I said round 20, but then I started getting getting on a tangent. And now we're on round 22. But at the end of this round, we will go ahead and escape the island. But that's the thing that happens. When I'm having a lot of fun playing a zombies map, I don't want to ever stop playing it. Until I'm like, unless I'm on like round 100 and then I'm, then I'm bored, of course. But so fun. So fun. I could play this. I could honestly play this map forever. But. Oh, oh, the round ended. Go. We must escape the island. We must escape the island. There we go. We'll be all good. We'll be all good. 36,000 points exactly. And there we go. We have officially escaped the island. Enjoy the little bit of little tiny cutscene. I won't be talking during this, but we have officially, we have officially escaped with our USA, pardon me, our USAS in hand, and off we go to some unknown location. Any Easter eggs? Any Easter eggs at all? No. There's a plane though. Plane not crashed. But there we go. 23 rounds, game over. 770 kills, 174 headshots, 91,000 points. That was a lot of fun. That was a lot of fun. I really, really enjoyed this custom zombies map. It's a good one. It's a very, very good one. Definitely would give it probably a 7 or an 8 out of 10. Really, 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 really enjoyed that. And I hope you guys enjoyed my very first custom zombies playthrough as well. I had a great time playing that map, as you guys couldn't tell. And yeah, hopefully you guys will check it out in the... Uh, in the description and see how what you think about it it was it was a lot of fun but anyway guys leave a like if you guys enjoyed subscribe if you are new uh make sure you check out all my other previous return to videos as well as my perk jingle video from yes from saturday i guess uh, hopefully you guys had a great mother's day as well uh, but anyways as i said make sure you leave any suggestions of any custom zombie you would like me to play down below in the description i will 100 percent play that map for you guys here uh, very, very soon in the next couple of weeks. So anyways, I will see you guys all in another Call of Duty video very, very soon.